You know, and I've shared this before, but they mess up all the time. They don't sit and beat themselves up for the next four innings. I promise you, they'll replace you quick. You got to get over it. And wherever you're at, you got to just put it behind you. Put it under the blood and get you a fresh start. That's the beauty of this. And you learn from your mistakes. And then you strive to enter in that straight gate as you walk with Jesus. And if you slip and get money, guess what? He's made provision for that. Just don't make a home there. He said, go and sin no more. Neither do I condemn you, go and sin no more. You got to learn to walk in that. Ooh, isn't this good? I mean, it's like you go out and work a vehicle and you get a new one every morning. That's expensive, isn't it? I'm going to tell you what. What we have is very expensive. And we're not redeemed with corruptible things like silver and gold, but with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. And his mercy endures forever. Amen. If you would stand, then I would encourage you to join hands with somebody beside you. And we're just going to agree together in prayer. I'm very confident in this fact. Jesus loves you this morning. He loves you. He loves you so much that he died for you. And he wants to bless us and strengthen us. Let's pray. Father, we come before you right now. And we just thank you so much for what you prepared for us. We thank you, Lord, for salvation. We thank you, Lord, for your satisfaction. And we thank you, Lord, for your blessings that are available to us. And Lord, help us to just become more spiritual so that we can see your blessings that have been made available and believe for those blessings. Lord, you are our source, and we know there's no other. It is you that gives us everything that we have, everything that we need, and we acknowledge you and we thank you. Lord, I pray that you would just help us to embrace you in every way, that we walk under the blood. Lord, that as we go forward with you and we make mistakes, Lord, that we not just let that beat us up, but that we put it behind us just as you do as far as the east is from the west. And we just realize your renewed mercy that's available to us on a daily basis. Lord, keep us safe. Keep us healthy. Lord, bring us back. And Lord, I pray that you would multiply this church, that souls will be added to the kingdom, that sick bodies be healed, and that people would just find true, total deliverance in what you've done for us. And we will thank you, and we will give you praise because you rightly deserve it. And we ask all these things in Jesus' precious name. And the church said, Amen. Amen. Shake hands, be friends.